Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. In this video, I will show you the easiest way to upgrade Windows 10 to Windows 11 on unsupported hardware. If you want to upgrade your Windows 10 to Windows 11 on unsupported hardware, this video is for you. So, let's start it. First of all, to check our Windows version, simply search for WinVer. As you can see, we have installed Windows 10 version 22H2. To check for Windows Update, search for Windows Update. As you can see, it is clearly mentioned that this PC doesn't currently meet the minimum system requirement to run Windows 11. You can download Git PC Health Check, but I am not using this app. Before you start upgrading to Windows 11 from Windows 10 using this method, you need to upgrade and install Windows 10 first. We have updated it. Let's install it. Once the update installed, restart your PC. Okay guys. After installing the updates, I have restarted my computer. Now if we check for updates, you can see it is up to date now. Now let me tell you one more important issue. For the safety purpose, if you have important data in your system, make sure to back up all your important data. Now we need to download ISO file of Windows 11. To download ISO file of Windows 11, open any of the browser and search for Windows 11 ISO file. On the first link, I will add this link in the video description. Click on it. Scroll down. If you don't want to face an issue during the upgrade, make sure to download the correct version and select the correct language for this ISO. From here, select ISO 64, click on download now, select the language, select the language which you have already installed. As you can see, you need to choose the same language. To check the language, simply search for CMD, run CMD as administrator, yes and type this command dism space backslash online space backslash get dash intl you can see the default system ui languages english us we will select english us confirm Click on 64-bit download. Yeah, the ISO file will be downloaded as it is 5.4 GB. So we have to wait for some time. As you can see, the ISO file downloaded successfully. Let's open the folder. Now let's drag and drop it to desktop. Now we need to extract the ISO file. If you have WinRAR, you can extract it, otherwise you can download the free version of WinRAR by searching WinRAR. Click on the first link, download, download, open the file, install it. Done. Now right click on the file, extract it, this is the easiest method to upgrade Windows 10 to Windows 11 on unsupported hardware, open this folder, as you can see we have all the file which we needed, now Right click on the same folder, click on new, 
text document, name it as setup, enter. Now double click on this setup file. Let's change the format. Now write setup space backslash product space server. Now to make this file executable, we need to save it as batch file. Click on file, save as setup, save it as setup dot bat. Click on save. Close this one. As you can see, setup dot batch file is created. No need for this file. You can delete it. Now, double click on setup file. You can see the prompt. Click on yes. You can see it shows install Windows Server, but it will upgrade Windows 10 to Windows 11 on unsupported hardware. If we click on change house setup download, click on not right now check our pc click on accept here you can select choose what to keep files setting and apps personal files only or nothing select keep file setting and apps next wait for some time ready to install click on install now it will take little time this is the easiest method to upgrade windows 10 to windows 11 on unsupported hardware depend on your pc performance it may take 15 to 20 minutes we will wait until the procedure completed Yeah, here we are. As you can see, we have successfully upgraded Windows 10 to Windows 11 on unsupported hardware. Now, if we check our Windows version, again, we will set for WinVer. You can see we have upgraded to Windows 11 version 24H2. Now, if we right click on Start button, click on Setting, click on System, Click on about. You can see Windows 11 Pro 24H2 is successfully installed. Now, if we check for Windows update, you can see it is up to date. Let's check for update. So, this was the easiest and effective method to upgrade Windows 10 to Windows 11 on unsupported hardware. So this was all for today's video. If you face any issue during the upgrade, you can comment me below this video. And if you find the video helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs and subscribe to the channel. See you on the next video. Thank you.